It may be an old cliché, but prevention is definitely better than cure. Which is why in this video, I'll show you how to back up your game databases in Chessbase 11. Now, information stored on a computer hard drive is not 100% safe. So backing up your database regularly is an important step to safeguard all that information. Especially in the event of, say, your computer crash, or even just one of the database files becoming corrupted. You will lose all your database information unless you have it safely backed up. Which is a very simple process in Chessbase 11. So first of all, select the database that you want to back up. Then, go to the Maintenance tab here. On the left you'll see a lovely symbol for Backup Databases. As you can see, this compresses all the files of the database into one single archive file, which can be stored somewhere other than onto your main hard drive to be used in the case of lost information or corrupted database. So when you click on Backup Database, this brings up the Archive Database window. And it gives you two options, cryptid or uncrypted. Now, unless you're a top-level grandmaster wanting to safeguard the latest opening theory that they've been working on, it really is better here to choose the uncrypted option. And the reason is, if you choose to encrypt your information, you'll need a password to access that database. And if you forget that password, there really is no way of accessing that information so it will be lost forever. So for most of us, it's much simpler and much safer to choose the uncrypted option. Then click OK. This will bring up a Windows Explorer window asking you where to save that database. Now it's usually good practice to save it in a different location, such as, say, an external hard drive or flash drive. You need to save it somewhere that isn't connected to the hard drive of your main computer. But for now, we'll just save it to the desktop of your computer. You can see here that the file name is already given with the .cbv extension. This is the extension for single file Chessbase archives. You can rename it simply by clicking on it and changing the name to anything you like. When you've chosen the location and name of your backup file, simply hit this button to create it. Depending on the size of your database, this will take a fraction of a second or maybe a minute or two. Now you look when you look at your computer desktop, you'll see a single file that's called backup. Here you can copy it onto a CD or DVD, onto an external hard drive, or even even email it to a friend. Basically, store it somewhere other than your main computer hard drive. So there you go, backing up your data in Chessbase 11, a very simple process that can save you hours of trials and anguish.